Hey everyone, I'm back with another video and in this video we are going to be taking a studio tour. In the month of March, Abner and I are super busy and for more of a detailed look at what we are doing, then check out my video where I'm painting a scene from our trip when we went on our honeymoon to Palma de Mallorca. Now, for the most part, most of this is art supplies or it's stuff that I do to print or whatever for art stuff, but there are things that are sprinkled in here from my previous job. My official last day is March 31st and before I leave for a trip, I'm going to be packing up all the stuff and shipping it to the designated locations. But for the most part, <laughs> It's things that I use on an everyday basis or it's things that I really want to try out. So let's get into this. Alrighty, here we go. And this is going to go pretty quick as I've tried to do this voiceover a couple times, but this is the chaos that you see when you walk in. Just some nice pictures, all my DVDs, and you can tell I... I like to collect them for a while. A vision board. And these are a lot of paintbrushes that I have that I really don't use anymore. It was when I was in my acrylic phase that I used these, but no more. This is a candle I made at Ember's Candle Bar, and it was like fresh snow, pine, and peppermint. And it, it was so good. I finished it before we moved into the new apartment and I was so sad. <laughs> These are my I am cards that my mom gave me. You pick one and then you read it. <laughs> it's just a nice motivation. This is the first shelf. And that book right there is actually the guest book that Abner and I had at our wedding. Our, the second shelf. <laughs> art books and such. That's my Trailblazers book, aviation related. And then I really like Harry Potter and dystopia books. The chaos. <laughs> it's so cluttered looking. Oh my goodness. This is uh, all my lined paper. Stuff I would need for a convention is here. And then drawing papers, tracing paper. This is actually the book that I'm holding all my charcoal drawings from like a certain year. I forget which year, but I, I might go through them in a different video. And that's AEA stuff. So two very dear artworks from family I love. This is kind of like storage stuff. So like thank you notes, cards, printing paper, etc. My water jars towel <laughs> and books that I'm reading or that I want to do on the channel. My storage area as well, so a nice toolbox where I keep a lot of stuff. I, and here I have like a lot of my drawing supplies. I think you can hear sirens in this voiceover, I'm really sorry. <laughs> but yeah, these are my drawing supplies, so like a lot of my charcoal, some pens, pastels, etc. Just keeps it all nice and handy in that convenient spot. And then in this, or actually I think I show you magazines. I have Game Informer and an aviation magazine that I still have not read yet. I need to. And these are all my watercolors and gouaches in this one. And this one are inks that I am going to be using for Inktober. This are just like bibbly bobs that don't really have a home, but that's their home, I guess. And then, of course, my pencil thingamajig. <laughs> my water bottle, my monitors, a charging station, etc., etc. I love that sharpener. Oh my gosh. Just pieces from all over, the top ones from Sydney, Paige Poppy's artwork, Mini Small's art artwork, photos, a family, all my camera equipment except for obviously the camera I'm holding, and then like my chargers, stands, little tripods, etc. 
These are all my like watercolors. I really don't do watercolor that often, but apparently I really like to collect watercolor paper. I'm sorry, I think that's another siren, <laughs> if you can hear that. This is all my daily stuff, so all my watercolor stuff, and, you know, lotion, fine liner, resist pen, etc. My pan pastels, which I use on almost every single drawing. I, apparently it's very important for me to show you my inhaler <laughs> and my eye drops. <laughs> I love that, that they, it's from World Market. Uh, I believe it, Watercolor Misfits maybe did a video on that and uh, she she told me about or she told me like she told specifically me she told she told in the video that World Market will sell those for like 10 to 12 dollars and so I got two I got a medium size and a large size this is really nice this is something that my mom and I well and my sister are currently doing and you just fill out a list every day and they it gives you prompts but then you do it like for three years in a row or, or something i don't know you write the year down that you're doing it in these are all my travel supplies so if i ever need anything i can just reach into this bin and grab it out typically i really only use the green pouch and the blue pouch because it has everything i would ever need but just in case I want to switch up the watercolors that are in the blue pouch, then I could grab one of those. Oh yes. And then my list where I remind myself to drink water and eat. <laughs> There's my Monfrotto arm my for like the overhead shots, but I don't do those anymore because of my neck and back. And this is actually the Yeti uh, microphone. It's what I'm doing the voiceover on now and I absolutely love it. Some artwork. Uh, I got that one on, in Prague on the St. Charles Bridge. And then there are just some of my pieces that you may have seen previously on my channel. That house is actually, I did not feature on my channel. It was a commission for a real estate agent and that's already been shipped off. So all my printers and scanners all the shipping stuff that I need. It's like ugly looking, but you, you have to have it. <laughs> and these are some of my rockers from the Art Prize show. That's Alice Cooper, uh, Janice Joplin, and uh, there's the Mick Jagger one. Oh, and Winston, hello. So that marks the end of the voiceover. Okay. All right, that's it for my tour. I know it was kind of a short and sweet one and I didn't go through every single supply that I have. We would be here forever. Maybe in my new studio area, I will do something more in depth where I actually talk as I'm showing you everything. But for right now, with all of the things that are going on, doing this type of video with a voiceover was just the easiest. So I hope you enjoyed it and I will talk to you later. Bye.